this morning we are celebrating all things Jennifer Coolidge, if you couldn't tell. The actress is currently in her renaissance era. After being on our screens for decades, she's become a bona fide icon thanks to her award-winning role as Tanya in The White Lotus. So this week, Jennifer is back on our screens, this time starring alongside J-Lo in a fun new rom-com. Just... Listen, I, I'm in desperate need of a massage. In the last few years, she's delivered some of her best work. I don't have to have deep tissue or anything. I take anything at this point. Anything, anything but Reiki, of course. But if you can believe it, Jennifer got her start in the biz exactly 30 years ago with a guest role on a little show called Seinfeld. I can't. No, yes, you can. <laughs> no, I can't. And not long after, she became... Stifler's mom. Jennifer then starring mom, alongside famous. Jane Lynch in cult favourite flick, Best in she's Show. Sweet. Vice versa. Yeah. Which led her to one of her most memorable films to date. Sometimes I say OK instead of fine. Since the early days of her career, Jennifer has become known for creating iconic characters and for delivering some real zingers. You're not very pretty and you're not very bright. Fast forward to now, and the world has fallen in love with her all over again. Please, these gays, they're trying to murder me. Could me capiche? For White Lotus, Jen has picked up a Primetime Emmy, a Screen Actors Guild Award, a Golden Globe, and a Critics' Choice Award. I, mean, I can put this down, right? No, I just... Uh, uh, I don't work out, you know what I mean? I can't hold it that long. And she's following that success with a fun new movie alongside J-Lo and Josh Dumal. I just want to ask, is that genetics or is it like Pilates? Oh, hello, Jennifer and Steve. Hi. Hi. Hello. hello. What a lovely treat it is to talk to both of you. Yeah, same to you. <laughs> Jennifer, you've had a huge couple of weeks. You've won a Golden Globe. You are the woman of the moment. I know. It does seem like a long, a long moment. <laughs> but a really fun moment. Yeah, what a fun night. Yeah, what, yeah I, love, I love surprises. And that was very unexpected. It's very fun. Very fun night. <laughs> it's your something borrowed. It brings you good luck, except for Uncle Greg, who ended up decapitated on that forklift. But and Steve, how much fun is it playing husband to Jen in a movie like this and filmed in absolute paradise, no less? It's stupidly great. Yeah, because they say, well, you're going to go to the Dominican Republic and Jennifer Coolidge is going to be your wife and we're going to pay you. And you're gonna, yeah, it was so, it was just a dream job. Because I've followed her career. I've, I've followed her. I stood outside your house one time. Um, I followed her for a long time. Wait, did you actually stand outside her house? Oh, no, that's not true. <laughs> that's a joke. I wouldn't say It's okay. <laughs> that's... But you know, Steve is, we all, everyone knows Steve, and, and especially all the comedians know Steve, and he's sort of, he's, he's, Green. he's very famous in the, <laughs> In the, he's the famous as the guy that can sort of come to people's rescue with like coming in with funny lines and stuff like that. So he, so, so I knew about Steve, and um, they were so weird. I think he thought like because I'm Stifler's mom or who knows what. It, but when I first met him, I was like, "Hey, so nice to meet you. I'm Jennifer." And you know what he said to me immediately? He goes, "I'm married. I'm." You invited your ex. Can I just say as well, how hot? is Lenny Kravitz. It's actually, it's a bit unfair. Yeah, it's stupid. It's ridiculous. Because he's like uh, 103 years old. I thought he was 170. Yeah. Yes, he is 170. <laughs> yes. He's, he's in incredible shape and, and he... Um, well, he doesn't eat dessert. That's the, He would look at it and he would have us describe our dessert to him. He's a very disciplined fellow. Yeah. yeah. Except he's not disciplined with his phone. No, he would use his phone at the yeah. dinner table. Yeah. You don't do that. Well, that is, that is very bad manners. Yeah. Nobody with my family. Carol, thank you for the cake knife. Oh, we love Jennifer Coolidge so much. And Shotgun Wedding premieres on Amazon Prime Video this Friday. And you know what? Jennifer recently said that she really wants to play a dolphin next. I think that would be an absolute. But what's the ultimate dream role for you now? What would be if you anything you could could happen? What would it be? I've always wanted to play a dolphin. A dolphin. Like a you mean like a like a half? No, like, like flipper. Yeah, something like that. So our gift to Jennifer this morning, besides having three beautiful ladies on set, is that we've turned her into a dolphin, guys. So there you go.
The bad she guy. is the moment, isn't she? Wow. They're nice creatures, wow. dolphins. Wow. Oh, very good. Wow. Dolphins have good PR, but they're not very nice mm. creatures. No, they're kind of cute at least. Wow. No, they're not cute. Oh, they're not cute either. Wow. They hunt in packs, they're awful things. <laughs> um, I'm not talking about... <laughs> You're not talking about us, right? No, no. He's, not talk... He's absolutely not talking about you. <laughs> That's beautiful. Thank you so much, Brookie. See you soon. Hey there, Today fans. Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my God. Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?